Now, let's get the article content type ready for inserting content. Go to Structure, Content Types, Article. Article content type already comes with Drupal, so you don't need to create a new one. Now let's scroll down. Publishing options. Let's uncheck promoted to front page. We don't promote to front page by default. Display settings. You can skip this. Menu settings. Let's uncheck main menu. There's no menu link we need to create for the article. We will use views to list out instead. So we can disable it. Let's save the content type. Now, let's create some new fields. Click Manage Fields. Let's create a few called Photos. We have already an image field here, but we will use it as thumbnail. Without this field, will allow for multiple uploads of more images. Alright? So field type will select image. And save. Continue, save, scroll down, file directory. It's always good to store files in a more organized way. So let's type article slash photos. Now for maximum image resolution, let's set to 900 times 900. You can set according to your own preference. But it's always good to limit the maximum image resolution. This will prevent especially the client to upload images that are too large in size. There's no point of uploading an image of 4000 pixels, for example, while you know well you only need to display a 500 pixel image. It's just a waste of space, right? We will skip the minimum image resolution, but you can limit it if you want to. Now scroll down. We enable the title field. Scroll down. Number of values. We choose unlimited. Save the settings. Now, just now I pause the video to install several modules for file field to support PL upload. PL upload will allow you to upload multiple images instead of uploading one by one. However, it takes some time to get it installed and set up, so we won't go through here together. I have recorded a video explaining on how to do all this on the YouTube channel. So you can click on the provided link to watch the video and come back to turn on the option as I'm about to show you now. If you have installed the modules, let's proceed. Or you can skip this part and do it later in your free time. Now back to our Drupal site. Here is where we stop. So let's edit the photos field again. Scroll down. And this time, if you have installed PR upload and file field sources modules, you should find this file sources. Open it. Let's choose advanced upload widget. Again, this option will allow you to upload multiple images. It's time saver. Let's scroll down. Save settings. We will create one more field called YouTube to embed the YouTube video. Field type. We choose long text. Let's save. Proceed. Save again. Scroll down. Make sure we check filter text so that we can use CK editor. Scroll down. Let's save the settings. Okay, let's proceed to the next. 